Hey Digicians, starting a digital business is simple and easy and it can be an effective source of income forever. In this video, we are going to discuss a solution through which you can launch your own portal for recruitment or a staffing agency and the same you can provide to your prospective clients. So we are going to discuss a online solution cloud-based solution for recruitment and a staffing agency. This is like a software and it uses a script to run. So you can simply launch this solution without having any technical knowledge at a very low cost and it is going to be quickly started. The solution is AI recruitment and a staffing agency software. Its name is CarePro that we are going to discuss. I am going to discuss all the aspects of this software so that you may understand and start your own portal or the same is available for your clients as well. So CarePro is loaded with everything that you need to effectively manage your staffing agency, create a beautiful and customizable website, receive and manage orders, manage employer and candidate relationships, recruit new candidates easily with job wash online courses, computer-based tests, and powerful filtering tools. So this is going to be complete solution. It offers three interfaces of login for candidate, employer, and the administrator. So since you are going to own this solution, you are going to be an administrator and same, you can assume as per your requirement. So it is AI powered, so it is going to be helpful in generating the content using the AI methods. The solution can be accessed on a website and this is funding website and it offers all the links that can be used directly by the users of this portal. So at the front end website users can explore the services like employers can check the profiles and create order forms and AI recommendation candidates can search for vacancy and courses and there are many things that you can show on the front end website and this is going to be a complete solution and you are going to manage this solution and it is a white label so you can definitely uh, sell this service to your prospective client as well so this is the complete website and without any further delay let us jump to the back end of this complete solution and i'll show you all the screens so that you may completely understand the data flow in the system and launch your digital business very quickly so at this channel digital be DJ sales. we are going to explore the things through which we can work smartly or we can launch your business in a very fast manner so and the investment is going to be very low so let us go jump into the back end of this solution i am here at the dashboard of administrator who is going to run the solution so this is dashboard and it shows all the basic information what is going inside the system like how many recent orders are there, the recent invoices, the graphs uh, of approved invoices, how many orders and all. So okay, and the first of all, the first thing that we need to do as an administrator or the owner of this solution to run for a setup so that we may configure the system according to our uses. Since it is going to be a white label solution, so you can change everything. Like you can change the site name, the homepage title, the homepage meta description, site email, all the details that is visible on the site like footer scripts, currency symbol. You can change everything that you want to display at the front end website. And further, we have AI settings. Like if you, if we want to use the GPT services, we need an open AI API key and the uh, open AI organization and also details can be directly in configured. So AI can be directly configured to the system without any trouble, but just by putting the credentials that we can opt in from the AI service providers. And the payment methods, we can configure the payment gateway through which we are going to collect the amount for providing as we are providing the services at different steps like employer and the candidate so the payment gateways can be easily configured again using just api keys that we can opt in uh, opt in from the payment gateway providers like stripe is very popular throughout the world and if 
it is uh, like PayPal is also here and we can see uh, so many payment gateways so we can definitely uh, get more payment gateways options is also here just in case if you begin at point but I, I'm not sure where it is going to work but yes so most of the payment gateways that can be widely used is available here Stripe can be good for India and everywhere as well pay you in basically for India so you can install this separately and the pay you is also available so it is totally uh, configurable and just we just need API key to to integrate the payment gateway further we have templates so job portal templates active templates so there might be different templates like all templates we have and we can select the front-end layout of the website so this is basically uh, for front-end layout like if we are providing the hiring agency uh, creating a hiring hiring agency for nanny services this can be humpty can be a very good choice and this is again nannies and the job portal for job portal this is the layout and this is uh, active by default so you can choose what you want to have at your website so this is for front-end of course you can handle the header menu in this setting so home page profile and vacancies and what is visible to the home page and the sub menu can be controlled here it is simple and easy so you can simply edit the content here and the details can be updated simply just like you are working on a word file further we have footer menu option and that we can change and update the content throughout the website uh, text messages and and like if you are willing to communicate through the SMS system, you can configure the SMS gateway like Tulo is very popular. So you can configure Tulo and other gateways are uh, also available and it is ready to configure the screen. So you just need to install and put the API key and it will start working. On the next screen, we have forms so we can handle the order forms and manage the sections of order form what we want to display on the order forms like we have edit options and the next uh, options and descriptions can be easily edited here for the order form so i'll show you the order form where it is being used i'm just uh, showing you the setting options that is available in the system first so forms language and uh, languages can be set like if you are willing to provide the solution in multiple language the option is here and uh, next is the administrator how many administrators are going to use this solution i mean who are the administrator who are going to handle this solution so you can set here next uh, manage users like how many users in the system not the administrator so administrator are different you know, having this different capacity and employer having different capacity so you can control all users from this screen further we have roles that we can assign to user roles like super administrator what are the uh, authorities of super administrator like super administrator have uh, does full power similarly we have admin so owner is going to be super administrator further administrator is going to handle the solution having full power but you know up to some extent there is some limitation so since it is a demo instance we can cannot edit but yes it is available for editing and all so like administrator can handle everything like orders employees candidates invoice vacancies and whatever is visible on the portal so administrator can do all the tasks and you can even assign new permissions or remove the existing permissions to administrator as well as a super admin you have control on administrators as well next uh, i have manage users so like we can manage users roles we have decide and if just in case if you want to disable the front end and want to run the solution in the back end in back end only so the uh, the solution is available in the uh, back end so you have to disable the system in the front end uh, api tokens are here in case if we want to configure the apis so it can be token can be generated and further uh, actions uh, can be run update is coming from the the script developer so in case there is any update you can update the script i mean the solution in just single click or by following the steps that has been advised by the developer so coming back to the dashboard setting is complete so now we can go one by one what is what are the next function what are the other functions like order is order is the next function so orders can be created like 
form number form and i'll show you the orders okay so it is the mark like that add new order option is here so this is ordered uh, so it has very limited fit candidate orders or the uh, another order form so we can proceed for creating orders like uh, general setting create new order so employer so such employer who is the employer for this order to what is the interview date so it can be configured here order can be created for hiring definitely we are running for orders for hiring solutions so this is all related to hiring and staffing nothing else not like product order so interview location and interview time and the candidates can be uh, filtered here so candidates can be found by typing the initial names a status like pending progress and the comments and create invoice so this is a staffing solution so there is everything that is chargeable so this is why it, this is named as order similarly you can see all the orders existing orders pending orders and order in progress completed orders and cancel orders in the employee sections you can create employer since you are super admin so you can create employer as well employer can create new orders so you can understand the data flow so if you are creating employer so employer can and create orders and further as in a staffing agency you can provide the solution i mean a hiring solution of course so this is the screen where the employer can be created and all employers can be seen here and for the actions so you can check the details of employer like this is the employer details and for the the edit options are here so you can edit the existing details of the employer you can send attached messages or the vacancies how many vacancies are opened by the employer and all so you can check all the records of existing uh, employer like placement records, invoices, notes and attachments and all. So this is uh, a complete control over employers as well. Active employers, inactive employers and even you can import the employers in bulk. Next is candidates who are enrolled to the system from through the, using the front end. Like this is the candidates and the vacancies can be here and all vacancies and candidates can apply. So it, this is the front end. I'm again coming back to the back end. So this is candidate information center, general details of a candidate and all the details can be pulled, fit here and further. Uh, our candidates can be onboarded on the system like picture is here, CV and resume here and the, all the employed like uh, a status of employment can be updated, shortlisted or not. So all the details related to a particular candidates can be updated there. Similarly, all candidates can be seen like public candidates and how we are uh, uh, given the candidates can be in log status. So it can not be public and that is available to hiring agency only. So this is very important feature that cannot be ignored. So you, if you want to keep the candidates only un, uh, under the control of employment agency it can be locked or if it is a public candidate so employer can directly hire the candidates of course they are going to create the order and you are going to earn money for providing this solution so like this is and the details of candidate and further actions can be done like make private option is here restrict the candidates and the shortlist of um, candidates even uh, unlock option and set as employed option is so Candidates can be handled well from this screen. On the next screen, we have AI recommendation just in case if you are using the AI tool. So you can have the recommendation from AI as well. So this is num number of candidates to shortlist and all. So this runs on AI program channel. So categories is here. So you can create new categories for candidates like nannies and the uh, live out nannies or whatever candidates the system is going to provide as hiring import option is here so you can import the candidates in bulk next segment next module is the training module so the portal can have online courses that like this is visible on the website as well so this is the website again just for reference and saying it so these are the area where the training and training is visible so you can run training and the courses uh, on the portals from here so that it may be very clear like details and the try and code try this course the option is here so the video can be made and okay so this is just a demonstration 
So there are many options like uh, students, how many students enroll to this particular training and certificate can be assigned to students after successful completion of training and all. So you can add new training courses there and the test can be done for the completion and all. Like course category you can create here. Further we have in the next module we have invoices so we can create new invoice, check the existing invoices. That is definitely for orders of candidates, hiring solution and all. So you can create invoice and further you can create invoice categories and all. Countries. If you are providing solution in multiple countries, you can create multiple countries as well. And it is very simple to create through this screen. Okay. Coming back. Uh, contact applets for different countries. So service ag level agreements. So you can edit the service level agreements and the contract. So this is also a very important thing since you are providing a hiring agency. You are uh, suppose a hiring agency needs this contract with the candidate since uh, the providing agency have to uh, keep all the contracts and details that they are providing. Okay, so this is very important from the legal aspects. Okay, and next uh, we have vacancies. So vacancies can be created or browsed all and the applications received for particular vacancy and the approval status reject or pending status can be updated from this screen. You can create new vacancies of course so since this is a hiring solution so vacancies can be created with all the details like in the job titles, the job description, closing date, location, salary, employer or job category. So you can definitely run or create vacancy for particular employer, employer and on. So this is all the hiring and the job category of course. So uh, once the candidate selected shortlisted interview is the next session. So next module is interview. So you can select the employer and schedule the interview and time and all venue and everything. So that candidate may reach to the venue and go for it. Uh, interview and on next processes. So coming interviews can be seen here uh, what is pending and the rest past interview what has been completed. So this is a hiring solution uh, software. So employer are going to uh, interact with the computer and uh, with the solution and as a super admin you have all the access to check all these things. Further placements. So if candidate are listed you can offer the placement services. So this is the placement screen and further uh, action uh, for placement and all. Next uh, module is the messaging through which you can email uh, message like you can create new messages for candidates and all and subject lines and uh, send now uh, attachments and all so like resume can be sent or all messages can be seen here uh, seen here and sent messages pending and email resources and all. Next is content like if you are showing the articles and blogs, so you can handle here. And in the newsletters, you can create newsletters. So this is super admin and the super admin has all the rights and you are going to be super admin just in case if you are running the solution. And if you are selling the solution, you have to give this super admin rights to your potential client and they can further create you their users according to their need. Now I'm going to show you different screen that is for Employer. So employer uh, have limited access. They can create new orders for profiles and like employer can always check the profiles of candidates what we, who are available in the system and further uh, shortlisting can be done by the employer and uh, after shortlisting employer can generate order forms. So this is the flow of data. So after uh, selecting the candidate, candidate, candidate order and the some form can be selected here. So but are the next steps so you can easily assume so, so after shortlisting order can be created and order form can filled out and the uh, created orders create order option is here my orders can be seen so how many orders are uh, has been created by the employer so this is employer screen further employer can post new vacancies so vacancies can be listed by the employer with all the details that i already shown you and for the invoices so if the services ha has been taken, so there would be invoices from the super admin. I mean, if you are the super admin, you are going to raise the invoices for the services and employer is going to pay you, uh, I mean, make the payment 
uh, for the service that they have taken from you um, from this portal of course so employer can check their invoices what had been generated and they can pay the amount so this is complete uh, earning model i believe you are getting now at the next section, the placement can be done by the employer. So placement details can be updated here by the employer. Uh, for the interview area and the interview area, what the what are the interview schedule for the employer can be seen here. So uh, if the placement agency, I mean the hiring agency scheduling an interview can be seen here by the employer and the contracts. So if any hiring has been done, so contracts can be seen here and further can be signed signed online so it can be printed here the uh, contacts can be printed and further signature can be done here so like this is signature option for the candidate and uh, contract and uh, undo the last stroke and save and sign so, so this is online agreement signing option so it is also a very good option and further uh, the account of the employer can be handled like chain password and the billing address and all so this is very simple screen, but it is very effective for employer perspective. Now I'm here at the candidate login. So can, what candidates can do with the system? So candidates can check all the details at the dashboard, what is available. Vacancies can be seen by the candidates so that they may apply and the details they can see and they can apply using the cover letter and all. Uh, similarly, the candidates can go for training the courses are available and what the courses has been enrolled by the candidates can be seen here and what test has been completed so take test option is here so online test is here start test options and all the question and answer will be available here so uh, administrator is going to create this test and the candidates are going to take this test okay so similarly we have uh, the applications that has been applied by the candidate so application can be seen here however this is a just a demo instance it is not visible here and if there is any placement for candidates it can be seen the interviews what has been scheduled and the type of interview like it can be a virtual interview then in that case the candidates can join the meeting here and further uh, if it is like physical interview the candidates can go to the venue so this is the interview area and further if candidate is taking services, he or she have to pay to you as a super admin. So this is the payment option by the candidate to the super admin, not to the employers. Yes. So and further can, contracts can be seen and the account of the candidate. So this is very simple procedure, but this is a complete solution for hiring and a staffing solution. And this is the front end portal front end website that you are going to manage as a service provider and at the login screen candidates can even register themselves so this is the registration form and all the details can be placed if can, the candidates can directly log in or employer even employer can register to the system directly so this is the complete earning model and it is a complete solution for recruitment and hiring and you can check the solution at your own as well credit and deals uh, has been given uh, on this page and you have to follow the video description link for buying the solution the solution is available ai recruitment and staffing agency software care pro is available at codecanyon.net and you can buy the solution for 69 dollars and once you buy the solution you can simply install it at your hosting at your domain and you might be thinking you are not technically sound to do all these things so don't worry we are going to install the solution once you make the purchase through the video description link that is an affiliate link and there is no fee for this support so we are going to make it live for you and you are going to directly going to use the solution check all the details and explore other videos as well what can be good for you or for starting a digital business for you and i'm sure you are going to start a wonderful business using this digital medium and that can be a good source of income for you in the next video, I'm coming with more solutions and till then, goodbye, keep watching, keep building. Thank you.